Hey guys, Mr. Movie, and today I'll be reviewing the original Man Who Knew Too Much. I said I would do this a while ago, yes, but, um, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna do now. So, uh, this movie is about a, uh, a uh, kid who was stolen, or, uh, no, stolen, um, abducted, I guess, by these, uh, people who want, um, I don't really know what they want. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, they were, they were, uh, taken by the, um, people, and, uh, parents went to go try to find them, because the police, like, a bunch of douchebags, but, yeah, um, and then, uh, so stuff I liked about this movie, the, uh, acting was great, um, there was Peter Lore, Peter Lowe, uh, he was in Casablanca and Maltese Falcon, and I think he's a really good actor, and he did a good job in this movie, and then there was the dad, I thought, did a great job, um, the mom did a okay job, I guess. And then the uh, score I thought was pretty good. Um, yeah, it was a pretty um, intense score sometimes. And then the uh, yeah the suspense, the score also helped with that. And uh, there was also a really good. Uh, it was kind of a there was no score during the gunshot at the end, but gunfight at the end. But um, yeah, you know it was still pretty cool to watch and stuff. And then the beginning didn't really make like it was a little confusing at the beginning. I thought um, it was hard to keep track of what was going on. And then also, you didn't really know the kid that much, like, or that well. If you knew the kid more, you might, you might have felt the same for the kid, but you didn't, so, yeah. And then, the, so I gave the original man who knew too much an 82%. Um, if you like Alfred Hitchcock, I recommend checking it out, or if you just like watching older movies, I'd recommend checking it out. Um, but yeah, so uh, see you next time, movie fans.